Legend of Total War here with part 31, I think, of my Call of Warhammer beginning of the end times let's play campaign as uh, Reichland. Alright, so previously uh, we declared war on Averland and it's all been going quite well. If we can get down here and take this settlement here, it might just destroy them completely. Did I order resolve this battle? I don't know, but damage is shit. Uh, no big deal. Okay, what I need to do... Yeah, I did order a result, I remember now. Okay, so what I need to do is come down here. Yeah, we've got to come down here. We might be able to hit it next turn. Alright, then I also need to... Oh, should I really have left... That one there. Well, it's too late now. I want to get these guys back over here for retraining. No battle is ever fought in vain. For all life is oh, uh, let me see here. We shall prevail. Because they could send some forces over here to fight us. Everything will come to pass. He's not exactly in the best shape. No battle. There will be no respite while one foe draws breath. All right. Well, you can have these. Hang on. How many do you need? Four cavalry. You can have them. There will be no That'll make a huge difference in how well they're going to fight. Do you have some offers for the dwarves? No. Alright, what are we doing? So yeah, we're ignoring this... Oh, hang on. I'm not ignoring this. What are we going to do about it? Drive them back to their homes! And what about this here? So Alright, fuck it. Let's sell you out here. We can beat them. We really need to take more of their settlements away from them. I'm trying to avoid finding the man in the field as much as possible and just take their settlements just so I can end the faction. But sometimes when they've got a lot of armies, it's unavoidable. You have to thin out the herd a little bit first. Alright. Let's see here. Let's reorganize this because it's a fucking dog's breakfast. Uh, breakfast. Don't have any artillery. We don't have many missile units. But I reckon if I put my missile units here, we'd get a few shots off on them. I don't think the guns will, but I'll put them up there anyway. Let's get the... Oh, hang on. And let's get these guys out there. F oh, bloody hell. It doesn't matter. Let's get them out here first, just to stand over here. Because it's going to be an all out attack, I think. Guys, out as well. Good, two percent kills. That's better than nothing. And they're just staying there. Oh fuck! That's actually bad. They're shooting at us. We're almost out. We should just make the attack now. Let's go. Hang on, we need to go wider. Please come around over here. You go around over there. Two to seven percent. So far, a good start. Those guys aren't going to make it back in time. Yeah, we just don't have time to wait around. Just get in there. You need to go take out any missile units you can find. Especially the ones that might be running the back. Go 
we've already got a bit of a mass route going on over here. It's good to see. Well, I wouldn't say mass route, just a bit of a route. Okay, looks like there's a lot of missile units over here. Good to get rid of them. These guys, they're terrible in melee, so don't even think about using them for that. At the very least, just stop them from from um, shooting. But then again, they're actually routing. Alright, I want you to stop shooting and, and help with this. God, they're breaking all over the place here. I don't know, maybe our general here has got a lot of dread. Good, everything seems to be going well. This is much better than I thought it would go, actually. They could not withstand us. Well, you did a shit job of running them down, but I'm sure we can still get that 85%. Okay, you two stop shooting because you're probably just going to get friendly fire now. So who's still standing? Oh, there's a unit of halberdiers over here. Oh, right, and then there's the other one. These guys coming in from over here. Ah, uh, no, stop that. Actually, you come over here, start shooting them. I'll put you on skirmish mode so we don't have to micromanage you. Just tell you to shoot him. And if you get into melee, it'll just really drive home just how shit skirmish mode is. I think we've... Yeah, we've definitely killed 85% of the first... Oh, that's not necessarily true because some of them have gotten away. Just keep running them down. going on here? Ah, oh, it's just one flagellant, that's nothing. Alright. Pretty sure the first time he's defeated. Alright, no more of this, no, don't need it. Can micromanage it from here. Hang on, there's guys running away, it's only like a handful. Uh, yeah, it's nothing. I mean, why fight them in melee when you can shoot them? Just trying to shoot our own troops, if you wouldn't mind. So far, so good. Now, if this was uh, Total War Warhammer, a unit of pistoliers would have used up all of its ammunition and not killed off, I reckon, the, uh, the halberdier. Good, we annihilated them there in that one. Very long load time on this particular battle for some reason. The enemy may be close at hand. We don't need the money, we need them dead. Praise Sigma! Victory is yours! Man, 
passion of chivalry. Well, I thought he would have had a lot of dread given how um, how quickly they ran. It would be really good to have more time, but I'm going to need artillery to take that on. I can bring my guys down here to assist on this one. What have they got? Yeah, they've got free company archers. I wonder if we should just wait for them to make the attack. They probably won't make the attack during the end turn. Oh, my spy's stuck in there. So just press M there. Right. Ostermark Capital Fort and Half. If it's got a full stack in there, it'll be too costly to take it on. What have they got over here? It's pretty much the same sort of fight as what we had last turn here. Possibility for a draw out. So that we can get to Castle Drakenhof. It's just, you know, it's this army here that concerns me, that's all. It's very large, but there's no general in there. I'm just, I'm just weighing up my options here, whether or not I think I can attack. Because if having a lot of command will make a big difference, but I don't know if he's a cavalry general. No, wait, yes I do. He is a cavalry general. Okay, good. That unit there is pretty much worthless. Right, if we rush at them, just like last time, their uh, archers won't count for very much. Alright, let's do this. The gods have granted this day to Odds are evenly war. matched. Okay, Experience not a problem. Let's do it. I mean, if we take a lot of casualties, not the end of the world. It just means we've got to recruit more from somewhere. I mean, we've been recruiting very heavily lately. Alright, let's reorganize this firstly. Okay, first things first. Put the missile units up on the wall. See if they can get a few pot shots in. See if they fall back a bit. Because they because they've got a lot of archers, we we don't want them hanging around this area. It's good to get a few early kills in, even if it's just a couple. Alright, good. Let's get out here. So even though we don't have a lot of cavalry, we'll be relying on the general very heavily to um to take out those missile units of theirs. Because if we take out their missile units, that's um, it's a large portion of their army, but then I've got free reign, I guess, to hit and run their uh, their main line. Okay, they're starting to come back. No, they're not. Got slightly higher ground, but it's not high enough to make a big difference. Get over here. You get over here. You get around over here. So at this point, it's like all in. It's everything or nothing. The bounce of power is slightly not in my favor, just ever so slightly. But I think we've got a tactical advantage over them because they've got no cavalry. This could be a good thing. Obviously not necessarily. Um, charge in. Oh, hang on. They've got cavalry. Oh, it's just some pistoliers. Ah, shit. Why didn't I see them before? Okay, well, that's pretty much that unit of archers gone. Watch out for those pistoliers. Try to get around the back of their army. 
how are we going here with them? I'm sure the Pistolier is, is the general's bodyguard. Back. Shit, get back. Okay, slow back down to normal speed. How are we going so far? 5 to 8%. Not brilliantly, but of course we did just, just get, you know, shot to shit. Okay, I gotta find weak spots. For fuck's sake. Might be better off just to put them on skirmish mode. Those pistoliers make me concerned now. But there's a lot of guys in here that are about to break. Right, charge into this because we can break them. What are our guys doing? We didn't leave any... Ah, oh, fuck, what's this? Okay, get over here. Get closer. Good. Good, good, good. Breaking them allows us to push forward. Keep their missile units falling back. Try and catch those pistoliers if you can, because otherwise they're going to kill a lot of you. Ah, I, just, I can't fucking catch them. That's what I need to do. You, shoot them. Just get in there, get them. In the meantime, you just run them down if you can. We've got them on the run. Looks like we're winning the battle. Yeah, for the time being, just ignore... Not necessarily ignore them, but let the, uh, let the archers get them, because otherwise we just can't catch them. Come on, don't let these guys get away. We're probably not going to be able to kill them all. I mean, I just don't have enough cavalry on this one. Come back over here. If you can maybe here hit them, that might do something. So, the red line's right there. So look how many of them we've captured so far. That's that's heaps. Bouncer power's in our favor. That's good. Ignore those flagellants. Get over here. Wrap them. Good. Nice big fat rout. Alright, we got this. Make sure you run them all down. Because run them down. Quit with the delays. What's this? Those are my units. Okay, looks like the pistolers are gone for the most part. The enemy pistolers, I can't even see where they've gone. Must mean they, they're just dead. Okay, yeah, not 100% sure that we've, we've run them down, but at least we've repelled them. 88%, yeah, but a lot of them have gotten away. Alright, how are we going here? Okay, we've got a bunch of guys out this way. Free company, go run them down. So look how many of them we bloody captured. That's what I want to see. Like I've said previously, the amount of men that you capture in any given fight is usually an indication of how well you've done. I mean, unless you're using, you know, artillery. So 
We lost about a quarter of our forces. We'll get some recovery. What the fuck happened there? This just died all of a sudden. Oh, whatever. Who knows, that extra 19 men here might just be enough to push us over to 85%. And how many men are on this one here? It's like just a handful. I wouldn't worry about that. Oh, just on 85%. I hope it kills them. Because it's, it's, you know, it's 15% of their army killed for free. It wasn't quite enough. It might have been like 84.5%. Which means we have to fight them again over here. Including those pistoliers. Yeah, that really sucks. And our forces here, not in the best shape. They're still better than, than what they were in. Jeez, if I had gone after those three men over that were running away, I wonder if that would have actually been enough. I doubt it. Alright, what else is there to do? Nothing at the moment. I mean, we've got this here. You are not my liege. I think we can justify sallying out against this, because they don't have any missile units. I think, let me just check this. Yeah, I mean, they've got the Knights Errant, but they're not going to be able to catch my pistol ears. So basically, we're just doing the same thing as we did last time we were under siege. Send our guys out to shoot them. Go back inside, wait until next turn so that we get more ammo. It's not um, Northern Marines. The unit cards look very similar. Okay, just wait for them to be a little bit further back. Now, if we can take out those knights, that'll be really good because they'll be very good against shooting knights. It's a little bit risky though because knights are the only guys that have even a chance of catching them. So good. It, even if it, we only got ten percent, that's still still a good result. But we got plenty of ammo left over. Still, I don't think those knights want to come at us just yet. myself into a fucking hole there. Get out. It's okay, I only lost two men. Oh, oh wait, make, make it three. Try to shoot those knights. Archers are out of ammo. Kill 22% so far, that's good. How many did we get? We got a few of them. You know, it's better than nothing. Need to start looking towards perhaps getting back inside. Why would that idiot stay out there, you know? 
It's their own fucking fault they get killed. You know, give the order. If you don't follow the order, then, you know, it's your own fault. Right, you're gonna have to come back in from over here, I think. Let's see if we can just use up the last little bit of ammo. How do we go? 30% of them dead. That's not bad at all. Could probably get more kills just by utilizing the towers, but really, what's the point? And what the fuck? Why would we lose the battle? We don't have any guys out there. Maybe it's because they're close to the um, to the walls. I mean, I don't know what they're doing over here, but. I guess it's alright if we just sit here and shoot them. Here, you come over here, get up this way because that way this tower can operate as well. I don't know what's going on there. Must be someone still stuck inside. Uh, outside, I don't know. Alright, now if we went this. Okay, Sally Out's been successful. We only lose the four, that was whatever. So, still kill the third of them, that's, that's good. Now, we probably could have gone out there and actually finished them all off, but it'll be less costly on us to, to just wait. I mean, we're still waiting for the recruitment pool to increase. It'll continue to increase just at the same rate, under siege as it would be normally. See nothing available there. I could retrain a few units, but it's fine. Come and fight me, if they were to make the attack on us now, I reckon we'd repel them quite easily. Alright, so coming back over here, I don't know if I really want to do that draw out. He could be a cavalry general. I mean, we can give it a shot. I probably need to bring everything I've got, though. Apart from, like, one unit. Leave, leave someone behind to defend the settlement. And just hit there. Okay. Just curious. Balance of power's in my favor. We need to annihilate them. So the enemy will be coming in from the north east. So I think we should just rush at the first army, get rid of them, then turn around, prepare for the next one. Oh, he's corner camping somewhat. Camping on the hill. It's alright. Doesn't really make much difference. Um, we'll come up there as well. We'll come and join them. Make sure nobody is on spear wall. And to be honest, I really, I truly just don't see that much benefit in spear wall. Maybe it increases their attack or defense by one or two points, but. Why well, not? Like, pike wall I get for pikemen, but. For halberdiers, it doesn't seem to make much of a difference between this and just normal. Oh shit. Yeah, 
Yeah, just trying to get as many kills as we can before we get over here. And if you guys would be so kind, charge into them. He'll probably break. And then we'll run him down. You need to stop shooting. Where are you? Oh, shit. Yeah, I may have fucked you over a little bit there. You better get up here. Now that we've got the high ground here, we've got a very good defensive position against them. If they decide to attack us. Up on the hill. Good, that one's been wiped out. Let's reposition. Liz. Yeah, you need to definitely shoot those. Okay, he's he's an infantry general. Okay, that makes things a lot easier. There's no escape for them now. Because we've got them roughly in the middle of the map as well. So focus fire on them. I want them pistol is gone. Good. And let's charge. charge down like a madman, make sure our line's intact. You can't do formation attack in um, Medieval 2 like you can in, in like Total War Attila. They just didn't implement it by then. But the infantry charge bonus is not really that high in this. Especially since I don't really count on them, you know, killing the enemy so much. All I use the infantry for is to assist in breaking the enemy. That's, that's how you play in Medieval 2. It's all about breaking the enemy. So if you can charge over there. Oh, yeah, we need we got, may need to kill the enemy general. Um, maybe focus on getting rid of these first. Yeah, you just keep shooting those greatsword bodyguard. they break? No, but they're they're still getting cut down. Definitely winning the battle. He's getting shot to shit. He hasn't even lost anyone yet against them. But then again, he's got a lot of experience, so I'm sure that makes a big difference. Go here's not fighting someone. The fact that we're not really breaking anyone isn't great, but we're because we got, I guess we've got the high ground and we overwhelm them by so much. We're not really taking that many casualties anyway. How long is it gonna take? Run them down already. I need to kill this shithead. Okay, their missile units at this point uh, are so few that I wouldn't really worry about it too much. What the fuck are you doing? Sometimes the pistol is, they just don't listen. I charge into the, the general there. if we killed him, we'd break the rest of the army. It's just that attacking him head on, not so easy. Okay, the whole army broke, pretty much. Okay, now we've, we've killed enough, but we should definitely try and kill a few more. Just in case. Yeah, that ought to do it. Okay, that means the settlement is mine. The, the draw out has worked. The 
enemy Good, Waldenhoff will be back in my possession. Let's take that and sack it. Have we still got enough movement? Okay, we've got enough movement to besiege Castle Drakenhof. I'm sure if that's what I really wanted to do. Actually, yeah, I don't, I don't want them to hold that. I'm just going to leave the spearmen behind. If we attack, yep. Okay. It'll probably be quite, uh, probably be uh, quite costly to actually take that. But still, we we took Waldenhof. That's good. We've, we've killed so many troops with this army here. If they were a little bit more diminished because of it, so be it. At least we've taken settlements away from them. They're really suffering at the moment. That's that's what we want to see. We await your command. Okay, what I'm going to do with these guys, I'm going to leave behind a unit of Empire Swords, and I'm going to escort these cannons to Nuln, where we might be able to pick up some more soldiers there as well. I will make it so. I mean, yeah, we'll definitely be able to pick up some more soldiers. Um, do you want more mortars? Wouldn't hurt. They cost a lot in upkeep. I mean, I know they're good in everything. Give me some more cavalry. I, I really like those units there. Alright, now I've got 76,000 uh, 76, to fucking spend. That is a lot of money. Oh, shit. Okay, if it's doing that, i got to end the episode now because the game is about to crash. So guys, like and subscribe. Part 32 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.